On April 30th, your Homeland Security Advisor, John Brennan, acknowledged for the first time that the U.S. uses armed drones to attack terrorists. Um, my question to you is, do you personally uh, decide who is targeted, and what are your criteria, if you do, for the use of lethal force? Well, I've got to be a little careful here. You know, they're, they're, they're classified uh, issues, and a lot of what you read in the press uh, that uh, purport to uh, be accurate aren't always accurate. Uh, what is absolutely true is that uh, my first job, my most sacred duty as President and Commander-in-Chief is to keep the American people safe. And what that means is we've brought a whole bunch of tools to bear to go after Al-Qaeda and those who would attack Americans. Uh, you know, drones are one tool that we use and our criteria for using them is very tight and very strict. Uh, it has to be uh, a target that uh, is authorized by our laws. It has to be a threat that is serious and not speculative. Uh, it has to be a situation in which we can't capture the individual uh, before they move forward on some sort of operational plot against the United States. And, and this is an example of where I think there's been some misreporting. Our preference is always to capture if we can because we can gather intelligence. Uh, but a lot of the terrorist networks that target the United States, the most dangerous ones, uh, operate in very remote regions and it's very difficult to capture them. Uh, and we've got to make sure that uh, in whatever operations we conduct, um, you know, we are very careful about avoiding civilian casualties. And in fact, there are a whole bunch of situations where we will not uh, engage in operations if we think that there's going to be uh, civilian casualties involved. So uh, we have an extensive process with a lot of checks, a lot of eyes looking at it. Uh, obviously, uh, as president, ultimately, I'm responsible for decisions that are made by the administration. Uh, but I think what the American people need to know is the seriousness with which we take both the responsibility to keep them safe, but also the seriousness with which we uh, take uh, the need for us to abide by uh, our traditions of rule of law uh, and due process. Sir, do you personally approve the targets? Hey, you know, I, I can't get too deeply into uh, you know, how these things work. Uh, but as I said, as Commander-in-Chief, ultimately, uh, you know, I, I, I'm responsible for the process that we've set up to make sure that uh, folks who are out to kill Americans, um, that we are able to disable them before they carry out those plots. Are the standards different when the target's an American? Uh, I think there's no doubt that uh, when an American has made the decision to affiliate itself with Al-Qaeda, and target fellow Americans, uh, that uh, you know, there is a legal justification for us to try to stop them from carrying out plots. Uh, what is also true, though, as an American citizen, uh, they are subject to uh, the uh, protections of the Constitution and due process.